Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this given math riddle by filling out these boxes so that we, when we add or subtract, we are supposed to get these values. All right. So let's go ahead and get started. Let me do the very first thing. Let me call these boxes. I'm going to call this box an A, this box B, this box C and this box D. Now let's look at these two boxes A plus B equals to 10 and that's why I wrote down A plus B equals to 10 and I am going to call this equation number 1. And now let's look at these two boxes A plus C equal to 17. And that's why I wrote down A plus C equal to 17. And I am going to call this equation as number 2. And now let's look at these two boxes. B plus D equals to 10. And here I wrote down B plus D equals to 10. And I'm going to call this equation as number three. And finally, let's look at these two boxes, C minus D equals to 12. And here I wrote down C minus D equals to 12. And I am going to call this equation as number four. And here is our next step. Let's add all these four equations. Let's add the left hand side on one side and on the right hand side we're going to add up these numbers. Let's go ahead and get started. Let's add this thing. So it's going to give us A plus B plus A plus C plus B plus D plus C minus D equals to now let's add the right hand side numbers those are 10 plus 17 plus 10 plus 12 all right so our next step we are going to combine the like terms this a and a that's going to become 2a likewise b plus b is going to become 2b and c two of them 2c and we can see that this positive D and negative D, they cross out, they are gone. That is equal to when we add the right hand side number, that's going to give us 49. And we can see on this right and left hand side, we can factor out 2. This is going to become A plus B plus C equal to 49. And now I am going to divide both sides by 2. So that means this 2 is gone. So that is going to give us A plus B plus C equal to when we divide 49 divided by 2. That is going to give us 24.5. And therefore, I have nicely wrote down A plus B plus C equals to 24.5. And I am going to call this equation as number 5. And here's our next step. Let's consider this equation number 5. And here I wrote down A plus B plus C equals to 24.5. And as we can see that A plus B by just looking at this equation number one we can see that a plus b is 10 i am going to replace this a plus b by 10 and then plus this is going to become plus c equals to 24.5 isn't it let's move this 10 on the other side so c is going to be 24.5 when we move 10 on the right hand side becomes negative 10 so that means c is going to give us 14.5 
So thus our C value turns out to be 14.5 and I am going to write down in this box. And now let's go ahead and repeat uh, the same process all over again. Let's consider equation five once again, which is right up here. Let me rearrange this one a little bit. A plus B plus C could be written as I can write A plus C plus B equals to 24.5. It doesn't make any difference. And now let's look at A plus C part. And by just looking at equation number two, we know that A plus C is 17. I am going to replace A plus C by 17 and then plus B equals to 24.5. Let's move this 17 on the right hand side. So B is going to be equal to 24.5 minus 17. That is going to give us B equal to 7.5 as our value. So thus our box B is going to have a value 7.5. And this time we are going to consider equation number 1 which is right up here. And here I wrote down A plus B equals to 10. And look at this B value. B we just figured out 7.5. Let me just go ahead and replace B by 7.5. That is going to give us A plus B. We are going to replace it by 7.5 equals to 10. Let's move this 7.5 on the right hand side. So A equals to 10 minus 7.5. So that means A is going to give us 2.5 value. So therefore our box A has a value 2.5. And this time we are going to consider equation number 3 which is right up here B plus D equals to 10 and I have just copied it down over here and we know the value of B which is 7.5. Let me just go ahead and replace this B by 7.5 plus D equal to 10. Let's move this 7.5 on the right hand side. So D is going to be 10 minus 7.5. That means our D value is going to be 2.5. And thus here is our D value which is 2.5. And here are our A, B, C, and D values I have nicely wrote down. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.